There we go. Got that gosh darn panel. Nice and in place. Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know. Welcome back to Let's Play Wario Land 2. The last time we beat up a giant snake, and we also found an alternate way further down into the cellar. So we're going to take this alternate path. We get to our money vault, but the money's not there! Oh no! We need to go remedy this situation immediately. Oh, there's the darn... The darners. Oh no, a sinking feeling. We've fallen down a chute. And we shall defeat a giant spearman once again. Oh, that was nice and convenient. It was kind of too bad that I didn't record... Um, actually, what's in this door? It's kind of too bad that I didn't record my... Um, my run through the uh, level to get the, um... Oh, I can't see anything. Yeah, my run through to get the... the picture panel. Because... I actually got two... Uh, silver coins, not only two silver coins in the level, two silver coins from the same charge. I was fortunate to uh, be able to get both of them back. Uh, I jumped too early. Monies. Yeah, we're not going to see quite as many um, fake walls anymore. Now, this is not technically part of Wario's castle. Well, it kind of is, but it's more or less like an, unfish an unfinished basement. And what a basement it is. God dang it. You know, I'm gonna open these barrels. One of them has to contain a monkey. Eventually, right? That's how barrels work, right? Hmm. And some more dark rooms here. I see myself a breakable barrel. And lots of monies. Okay, so this guy will, um will inflict on us another one of those famous status ailments. And in this case, it's the uh, spring ailment. I use this to our advantage to get some coins. Um, of course, can dispel this with water, but it will also go away on its own after a certain period of, period of time. As you can see. Now... 
Trying to remember which door goes where. I didn't play the entire game uh, prior to playing this, but I played a fair chunk of it. By a fair chunk, I mean I'm getting pretty much to the end of what I played. Large money stores. I don't know how Wario fits all this in his pocket. Ah, oh, great. Things are still dark around here. be a switch around here somewhere. Ah, there's one. Now those ghosts will inflict the uh, zombie effect on us. So it's up to us to avoid them. While of course still getting as many coins as possible. Ah, turn the lights on here. All of the monies. Yeah. I'm going to use you to destroy you. Which apparently it doesn't work that way. Good to know. Yeah. I need to stop risking my face for one single coin when getting hit by these guys will cost me six. Well, it's pretty much um, what I like to call gamer's prerogative. Now, here is the dude, but there's a problem. I haven't gotten the treasure yet. So I gotta go back. Even if we can't see the door, it's still there. Aha! You see? By having the lights on here, we know that there's a gap there that we've been passing over. And the, the uh, treasure puzzle is right here. Okay, nice little pirate thief dude. At the very place where my finger is pointing. We get a torch. Now if only we could use this torch to light up all of these dark rooms. Now let's go back and kick us some butt. faulty elect uh, electric system, if you ask me, where all of the switches affect all of the light bulbs. But the lights are not synchronized in any way. Some of them will be on, while some of them will be off. 
Oh, what are you gonna do? And a little more money. We gotta play us a panel puzzle. And hopefully not fail. Here we go. Could be a six or a five. That's a five. There it is. And another panel to add to our growing collection. Right over here. As you can tell, these panels will form a picture eventually. That's why they're called picture panels. Isn't that a thing? Avoid the rocks. I don't know, man. That seems like a tall order. Yeah. Now there's a little thing here. If I can do it just right. Yes. Get up here, which gives me a much better vantage point to get all of the coins. Well, almost all of the coins. Sufficient a number of coins that I am satisfied. I think I saw something. Yeah, see? Aha! A little tiny passage here. Not exactly comfortable. Ah, this is another status effect. You see these blocks? I can't break them right now. Because I'm not heavy enough. So let's uh, eat some anti-diet cake, become very fat for a few seconds, and we'll be able to just walk it off, because of course. I don't think I'll be able to get to those big coins though unless I break these two. Dang it! Mm. Okay. There we go. Work it off. Because Wario has the most bizarre metabolism in the history of everything. Boing. Boing. Okay. It's a nice little stash there. Will definitely help us if we can find the uh, treasure room. I think I had some difficulty finding the treasure room, actually. Now you see that there are big rocks and there are small rocks. The small rocks you can pick up. The big rocks will crush you. It is not mandatory to avoid the rocks. Also, note that there will never be a um, there will never never be two big rocks in a row. There we go. Get some money. Ah, and some more fake walls for more money. Ah, let go. No! Ah. Uh, 
Well, that's never happened before. It just kind of stopped. Just not all of the, um, not all of the holes in the wall will spit out, um, boulders, or any sort of rock. I didn't need that. Which I think I actually did. Yeah, in order to use this basically invisible shortcut, that you don't really know about until you actually get... Oh, come on! Bounce the correct way. Quit being dumb. I said uh, quit uh, being a uh, dumb. I'm blaming this entirely on the... Really? It's really not that hard, see? Bounce, and there we go. There's some more coins up there. Come to think of it. What I'm gonna do is... Go back down here. Okay, I was hoping that the, the uh, guy here would respawn, but I guess not. So... Exit and re-enter. So what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna get you, or you, you know. Oh, come on. So I can't get you, because I need you to get up here. I can't get you, because you fell down there. I can't get you, because you fell down too. Goodness. Okay. <laughs> Wario jump. Wow. Okay. There. Now I have a dude. Put you down here. Bounce up. There we go. That's what I meant to do. Now I can destroy all of you. And also fall down holes. Because Wario won't jump. can uh, turn you back to normal. If I can possibly respawn the guy in his original location. Taking damage. I guess that wasn't entirely more useful than uh, just going for the water, but whatever. Also, because I'm this kind of guy, is there anything up here? No. I can't even bounce high enough to get off screen anyway. Okay! 
Aha! I'm on to your tricks, game. Ow. Actually, yeah. Put one up there. Get spiked by the other one. Really? Wait a minute. I felt the... Oh my goodness. There's definitely something. Oh, come on. Yeah, I don't really care anymore. There's something, I just don't know what it is. And I don't know... Okay. I want to bring... This ball thing... Down with me. See what I can. Yeah, that didn't. Uh, that didn't seem to really solve anything. I'm gonna keep checking the wall. Ow. Hmm. There's a door here. Ah. I don't think I found this treasure while I was practicing. That pirate dude. I actually almost missed it. Wondering, ah, there we go. Aha! That's what this little path was. Just like with pretty much any other um, Wario game, always be checking the walls. on rolling on the ground here. Huh. Maybe I can get crushed somewhere. Yeah, definitely. Squeeze through. Not entirely sure how I'm supposed to get those coins. Maybe there is an actual enemy that I could throw into there. Ah, no, let go. There is the exit, but I still think that there is a little something. Yes, okay. I need to get crushed here. Go all the way down. Hey. Now I can scoot over these gaps and just add water. like a McNary. Ow. There we go. 
And what's over here? Oh, I see your tricks. I see your tricks and raise you lucky charms. Too rich for your blood? So rich for your blood you're getting diabetes. Oh well, yeah. I mean at that point it's time to stop. Okay. So that's about all of the um the treasure that I will be able to wrench from this level. Time to go. And this pretty much as much as I've um as I've played ahead of time, so. Time for the panel puzzle. Two, one, go! It's very in. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that has to be a one. I could have gotten it one tile sooner, but it took me a second to kind of realize. Let's put another panel in the picture. Down we go to the next level. Stop that train! Why is there a train in my cellar? This makes no sense. There, there was not a train station when I bought this, um, when I bought this house from the genie. At least if there was, I was not advised. Like it. It's a very light melody for uh, for this train. It's entirely possible that they left it light so that. Um, So that they would have um, audio tracks empty for the um, train noises. Yeah, dang it. I think that uh, the gap I just uh, skipped would just take me backward anyway. No! spot, buddy. Thank you. Yeah, and that just leads back to here. Gah! It's really dumb positioning. Perhaps I need a better positioning system. Something a little more global. I call it the global news team. No, silly, the global news team is unknowable. It's unknowable. No one knows who's in it. That's the whole point. Thank 
you. Ah, ah. This is really annoying, especially since, um... Come on. But yeah, the top of the train basically has wind physics. Oh my goodness! There we go. Wasn't done up there. I just found it weird that there were two coins there. I thought that meant uh, there might be something breakable, but I guess not. Oh, really? I'm gonna have to leave and come back to respawn the, the pirate dude. And off we go to the races. Oh, this looks like something that'll stop the train. Problem though, we don't have the treasure yet. I have no idea where the treasure drawer could possibly be. Actually, oh, there it is. Yeah, I hadn't been to this section yet. Um, I'm gonna go with normal, since we don't have a whole lot of coins. Monkey man. Looks like a monkey anyway. Ah, I think I got it. This one. We got the moon. We got the moon. We got in June. We got a spoon and gonna foon. It's not a foon. It's a spork. I know that uh, it's officially called a spork, but um, I was watching a long time ago Bill Nye the Science Guy, and the word foon was suggested. And quite frankly, I prefer the word foon to the word spork. It flows better. Time for panel puzzle. Now let's see what this one could be. And there could be a lot of things right now. I think it's a two. Yeah, that's a two. That is a two. That is uh, that is a two also. Now we gotta find the exit. Because who know? I found the exit! <laughs> that was random. Well, we found the exit, but that doesn't mean we know how to get to it yet. It was just kind of floating there in space. Pretty sure there's a solid platform here. We're gonna have to get around to it the other way. Now, 
What's in here? Fork was uh, pointing the wrong way. Hmm. Ah. Oh, wait. Okay. Yeah, that works. No. What the? This be a lot easier with lights on. Let's go find some lights. It's bound to be something. What the heck? What just happened? Okay. There's a chef dude right there. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna find any lights over there. Maybe I'll find some over here. Ah. Here's a switch. to avoid uh, getting stretched out here, so I can get over here and hit the switch. There we go. Now I can see what I'm doing. Now I see that there are some blocks there that were um, impeding my progress. Now I see that there is a secret over here. Oh. It's an elevator. I get some elevator action going on here. I don't think there's anything uh, underneath that elevator, so... However, we are going to need the help of Chef Excellence over here to push the elevator over there down. Boom. Ah, there we go. Let's work off that excess weight. There we go. Getting there? Oh yes, there is. Ah. In fact, kind of looks like there was something on the other side too. In kind of a similar location to this one. Right here. There we go. Ed, dang it. Ooh, thank you. really hungry for your stuff right now. However, I saw a door over here. I want to get into that door over here. Now, 
I guess not. Oh, what an ele what a useful elevator that was. I can at least get into here. Oh, there's also a door. What could be in this door? Ha! A switch! Now we'll switch the lights. No, dag blast it. No! I cannot support your cake diets. Maybe I could support them for all those coins. Let's see if I can get down there with this cake. Actually, no, I can't fit here with this cake. Additional cake does not uh, make it last longer, so. Ha! I have found the treasure room. Okay, alien face. Gotcha. Got the alien face. And the lock off the thing. And we get whatever that is, some sort of orb. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get, uh, those coins. No, well. It's in this door. It's darkness. It's golden darkness. Well, maybe not golden darkness. However, I do see a way out of this nightmare. Although, I'm sure there is more treasures to be had, I'm gonna go ahead and take the exit, because these half-light, half-dark levels are annoying. I got the treasure, and that's the important thing. Well, except for the picture panel, of course. So let's complete a panel puzzle. Oh, that's gotta be one, four, or seven. And I think that's gonna be seven. It sure is. Lucky seven. Well, one more level, and uh, that'll rejoin us with another path that we can take later on. And, um, what's gonna happen here is, once I clear this level... Come on, get into the light, buddy. I know you want to. 
One more step forward. Uh, apparently the light doesn't bother you. What bothers me while I'm in zombie form? So you can kill a zombie as a zombie. That's good to know. Ow. God dang it! I said charge. There we go. There's definitely something down there. Yeah. Huge. Why are there a million zombies? Give me the light. Show me the light, my friend. Okay. There's clearly a thing over here. Maybe it's just a few coins, but hey. It's coins. It's money! Hmm. Wonder how I get those big ones. Maybe through here? Aha! Yes! Big coins! Now that's how I get there, but there does seem to be some stuff underneath, too. Aha! Come on to your tricks, game! Lots of breakable stuff. Huh. Now this new revelation is kind of upsetting, because how do I get up there? I don't know. There we go. That's how to get down there. This is unbreakable. Can't actually jump up here. Yarg. Okay. I'm just gonna have to drop that, I think. That's probably just to get to the other big coin. feeling like there's going to be a lot of digging in this level. But if I'm rewarded with uh, silver coins, maybe it'll be worth it. And one of these doors... Probably going to lead to um, the treasure door. That's the boss door. We don't want to go there yet. We need to find the treasure first. Where is the treasure room? Maybe in here? Nope. That's money, though. It's going to be money. I did see a door over there. I'm actually going to have to bring one of these Chef Excellence dudes up to the top. Yeah, 
And up we go. Bring our big old carriages up to the top here. Dang it. Get over there. Still need you for over here. And also for historic over there. Well, this might work actually. That's a matter of uh, cunning platforming. There we go. to leave and come back here. Because in order to get to this door, I'm going to need to break through with large amounts of girth. One might say girth brooks. Is this a treasure room? Yes, it is! Let's do it on easy. Looks like we're looking for Chef Excellence once again. Which is in spot number seven. Well, number seven in my point of view, anyway. I suppose it could be any number if you're going to assign numbers to them in your own different system. But that's different. Different things are not allowed. Tolerance? What's that? This is Wario we're talking about. And the only thing he's tolerant to is money. Now I gotta deal with this guy. Aha! Gotcha! That's how I deal with you. No. Oh. Okay, so you're occasionally going to jump. Dang it! Yeah. Why are you being difficult? Can't bear a little defeat? That's what I thought. Oh goodness! Is he naked? Oh, I know what he is now. Defeated. Ha! So that's going to be it for this video. We're going to do the panel puzzle. And then we're going to um, go back to the main path on the next video. This is going to be a 1, 4, or 7. That's a 7. Another panel. Yay! Put it right here. Save a game. Now that brings us to here, which is actually an offshoot of another um, spot.
template path that we'll be taking. But in the next video, we're going to go back on the main path so that we can start from the first level of that, um, of that split. So, I'm Coolio if you don't know, and I'll see you guys next time.